Yeah, now hen. Mm. I'm going to get you on the mat here. Now, th this this is quite an alien move to you because we were talking before. <laughs> because it's this so is, athletic. It's, no, because <laughs> it's just hard to do hen, isn't it? Yeah. So it, it really is. I mean, I'm going to show you in my practice what I'm trying to do. So usually I would break my right arm about here. I'm going to try and keep this straight. All right, all the way there. I'm not putting this on, by the way. I just am I'm fairly flexible, but this is... Okay, now from here, I'm going to get the hips going while I try and keep this to... My hands up there at the top, the hips are going to fire. This is all going to slot. And now my hands are obviously way ahead of the club. Usually from here, people would have to release, right? But the beauty of him having cleared the hips is that this can all come down in one motion and he can keep a really strong club face to arm line. That's another reason why he gets so much distance. Have you ever tried it like this before, Hen? Uh, no. I'm looking forward to this. Anything. Anything. Well, I'm not could, sure I am standing here. But we'll see. <laughs> could happen. I think the most likely scenario is that I break in half, but let's see. Dear. I'm going to try and do my best. All right. Width and hip speed. Oh, oh hen. Felt good. It's gonna make I think it. that's my new swing thought, you know. I'll tell you what, are you going to come back on tour, hen? Well, who knows? <laughs> <laughs> Let's, I'm, I'm, I'm very pleased with what I saw there, but... Um, and, and it felt good. It felt yeah. powerful, strong, athletic. It's actually a really nice um, feeling to have. Let's see just how well I did, what the yeah. data says. So we'll find out if I get width on the way back. I'm curious to see when my right arm breaks down mm. because it felt like it stayed straight for quite some time. Uh, I wasn't quite Cam Young, but for me, I got a really nice amount of width there. The hips fired. The hips are miles open here. My direction of force was good. There was nice weight transference. As we saw with him, his left foot was all the way turned over because he'd already cleared, done his mm. weight transference ahead of time. So, yeah, I'm guessing I not, that. not everyone can try this because you've got to be really flexible to do that move. Yes, I would say thoracic rotation <laughs> is probably the key. Prep the body, do the, the sitting on the chair one where you keep everything all still and then you just try and rotate your upper body round just to try and get this thoracic spine moving a little bit. Yeah. So uh, that's what I would say in terms of physical prep. Make sure the hip flexors are feeling good. Um, but yeah, a really super powerful athletic, uh, what's the word I'm looking for, technique from Cameron Young that, you know, I, I feel like I need a little recovery now. Yeah, a couple of a cup of tea. Yeah. Uh, Henny used to be powerful there and he's, he drives incredibly long. And here we are over the last couple of seasons. This is his driving statistics. He's averaged just a shade under 320 for the last mm. two seasons, ranked third each year. I mean, look at his longest drives as well. I mean, possibly they were at altitude or downhill, downwind <laughs> on a hard course, but you can see why those statistics with the swing that he has. That works, honestly. And when you're looking at that and you see him out on the golf course, it wasn't until I broke his swing down that I understood just why those numbers happen and just how actually athletic and powerful Cameron Young is on the low. Mm, yeah, superb from Cameron Young.